everyone, it is your boy Blazy here, bringing you a brand new video to kickstart your week. So I hope everyone had a fantastic weekend. My weekend was pretty so-so. I was a little bit ill. It meant I couldn't come to the London Cards show and film you guys any content. So I was absolutely gutted, but I'm feeling better now. And we've got a brand new box to open today. Uh, and it could be a pretty exciting week for openings as well, because there are some exciting products coming out at the end of the week that we've managed to get our hands on too. So if you cast your mind back a few years, Panini released Score in the UK for the first time in 2022, and it was the first kind of hobby product available here in shops in the UK, and it went absolutely crazy. Uh, and every year since, they've released Score around the April time, and it is probably the cheapest premium collection they offer, uh, and it's a great gateway into collecting. So in today's video, people, we are going to be opening Panini Score for the Premier League for the 23-24 season. There's three number parallels guaranteed, and the chance of an autograph card inside lucky boxes i think the odds are every one in four boxes is an autograph card so fingers crossed we have a lucky one today i've never actually managed to get an auto from score there's david beckham available this year so fingers crossed we get a nice big auto in today's video or our first ever packed one of one so we are going to waste absolutely no time people and we're going to get this video started but before I do so, if you enjoyed today's video, then make sure you smash that like button and do subscribe and hit the bell never to miss a single video from your boy Blazy. Like I said, there is a lot of exciting stuff coming this week. I should have Top's finest UCC dropping, hopefully before the weekend, so going on a stag do. Uh, and I should have Panini Don Russ by Friday, I reckon. So I fly to Portugal on a stag on Friday, hoping to have the boxes to take with me. So it should be an exciting week for openings. But for now, people, sit back, enjoy today's video, and let's open Panini Score Premier League. So here we have it, people. We've got a box of Panini Score Premier League for the 23-24 season ready to open in today's video. We've got three guaranteed number parallel cards and a chance at an autograph hit. So autographs for every four out of 10 boxes because it's four boxes in a case with an auto. So we basically got a 50% chance of getting an auto. Can we break our Panini Score autograph duck in today's video? I am excited to find out. So Panini Score, where does it sit? Uh, it's not as premium as Prison, but it's not as you know, not as basic as Adrenaline. So it sits in between Prism and Adrenaline. It's a little bit, you know, a little bit more fancy uh, than Adrenaline, a little bit more premium, a little bit more mature, uh, but it's not quite super premium quality. So you will find uh, with a lot of the cards in this collection, unless you hit a big player, they're not the most valuable cards. So I guess if you think about it, you've got Adrenaline for Panini, match attacks for tops. You then jump up a level. You've got score for Panini. You've got superstars for tops. And jump up again, you've got Prism for Panini, Chrome for Top. So this sits in between the base collections you find in your supermarkets and the hobby collections you find in your um, LCS stores, I guess is what you call them in the States. So sits in between the two of them. And yeah, you can get autographs inside these boxes, which is nice and exciting. So third year of Panini score. First year was a banger. Second year was a little bit mid. This year, I don't quite know how I'm feeling with this one. Don't quite know how I'm feeling. There are a couple of big players in it to be had, like Haaland, Foden, and David Beckham autographs, but there's also a lot of mid-filler autographs in this collection. So, not the biggest, but also not the worst, I guess, is where I've positioned this one before opening. It's also going to be one of the last years you will have a Panini Premier League collection because Tops have got the license of the Premier League starting in the 25-26 season. So, second to last year of score. Hopefully, we can get ourselves a banging card. So, hyped to get this bad by open, people. But before we do so, I am going to give you the lowdown on today's product. Each of these boxes retails for £80 over on Sports Trading Cards UK. They are my number one place to go for all your hobby needs. Uh, so you can check the link out to one of these boxes down in the description for that price. You get a whopping 200 cards per box, including three number parallel cards and a 40% chance of finding an autograph hit. So overall, I do give this one a three out of five star. The reason I give this a three out of five star is that you get loads and loads of base in here. It's going to overwhelm you. And equally... The autograph checklist on this one is really poor. The first year was mega with Ronaldo and co. This year is one of the poorest Panini score autograph checklists, if I'm completely honest. There's only three players I would say were super valuable. Your Haaland, your Foden, your Beckham. Other than that, there's not a great deal to chase inside this box. I do think superstars 
is a little bit better than score, if I'm completely honest. I think superstars, you've got a bigger auto checklist. You've got some super kind of case hits that feel really premium. The case hits in here just don't, they just don't hit as hard. So I think you had a choice at the moment. I would say superstars over score. But nonetheless, people, we like to rip all of these products. And maybe this will surprise me as we go through today's video. So people, it is time to get this box ripped. So like I said, people, later this week, I should be getting UCC Finest. And I should also be getting uh, Panini FIFA Donra. So, some super exciting things coming to the channel. So, with that in mind, people, if you love football card and box openings, then make sure you smash that subscribe button, never to miss a single one of my videos. So, we can now go into the normal camera view. Uh, I had to go super zoomed out to do that one, people, uh, purely because this box is so long. Uh, but there we go. Look at that. All oh, these packs of cards here, people. Uh, just as a little bit of a spoiler as well, there are filler packs in here as well. So when I say filler packs, filler packs basically have a big thick piece and card in here to make sure that people can't go into shops, fill the cards or fill the packs even and work out where the rarest cards are. So all the autograph cards in this are a little bit thicker than the rest. So obviously if Panini didn't do that, people would go through and literally fill every single pack until they found the rare ones. So super super hype now people here we go we've got all these packs to open in today's video we're going to move them to one side and we're just going to get ourselves started so first pack of panini score let's go people 20 packs to open 200 cards in today's video so we start off with a christopher and cuckoo of chelsea uh, design wise i do think design wise these are better than superstars it's the first time i'm looking at them Got a nice, neat design on there in the front. It does look a little bit more premium than years gone by. So I will say I am surprised with the card design on the base. Uh, you've got a nice little fact about the player on the back. So I do think you put this up against superstars. I do think this is a little nicer. I've got a Leo Messi here. Um, yeah, I do think the Panini score design is better. I think the player checklist is much better in superstars. But yeah, I think I prefer the. I think I prefer that design. Both got facts on the back. But yeah, score, I think, looks... A little bit nicer from that regard. So, a nice Christopher and Cuckoo to start. Flying through the rest of them. We have a Jared Bowen, John McGinn, João Gomez, Matty Cash. We then have a pure class insert. Uh, Marcus Rashford of Man United. Best insert of the day. We've got Raheem Sterling, Thomas Suchek, a Pedro Neto, and Leandro Trossard to finish. So, nice little insert that. I like that pure class. Pure class, Marcus Rashford. There we go, people. Not had the biggest season. Marcus Rashford has really struggled. Uh, do I think he'll find his form again? I do, but I don't think it's going to be at Man United. I can see him getting a move this summer uh, and going somewhere else. Just, I think there's a lot of problems with United. No shade, United fans, but there's a lot of work need doing there. So, next pack up. We've got Reese James, James Will Prowse, Esther Pinyan, Armando Brogia. Oh, first number of the day. There we go. Number to three of 20. And again, these parallels look nicer than years gone by. We have a nice three of 20. Mikel Antonio before. I think the cards are a little thicker this year. Last year, they just seemed so flimsy. Uh, and that sheen looks good. A nice pink three of 20. That is a nice number right there. Three of 20. Mikel Antonio is our first number card in today's video look at that sheen people it looks good doesn't it we're gonna have to get a cheeky sleeve on that one um to make sure we keep it nice and pristine there we go look at that first number of the day a little surprise mikhail antonio we're gonna have to go a little bit slower through the next packs <laughs> to make sure we don't spoil uh, any of those hits to come i hope that's not the only low number today people it's not the biggest player uh, there'll probably be a lot of west ham fans out there that would like a nice number to 20 antonio but, you know, we want the big boys or any Newcastle United will certainly do. So, Mikel Antonio, pink to 20, is our first numbered hit. So, just realised I hadn't moved all my base there. Going through the rest of the pack, we have ourselves a Van Heck, rookie. Ben Doak, rookie. Mohamed Salah, a Dringer, Edison. And that sees out the rest of that pack. So, first numbered there, people. Look at that. You also will get five silvers in here as well that are non-numbered. So I think we'll have some silvers coming up shortly. Right. We have Phil Foden up next and Evan Ferguson, James Madison, Jack Grealish. We then have, oh, hot rookies. A hot rookies insert, Ian Martin of Chelsea. Look at that. We've then got, is this the thick card? 
There is a thicker card here, people, I think. But I don't know if that's the one up next. Oh, no, it's not. We have Brian Buemo of Brentford. The next one we have got is Mateus Franca. Uh, rookie for Crystal Palace. Hasn't had the impact I think all Palace fans thought he'd have this season, but definitely one for the future. We have a Rasmus Hoyland of Man United, Ruben Diaz, Sam Johnston, and it sees out that pack. I thought I saw something really thick when I was doing that. Obviously, the cards. The cards must have just blended together. Ah, oh, people, the tease, the tease. Uh, right, here we go. Next pack right here, people. Uh, this card is back to front, which could be... No, I've just got the, I've just got, I've just got the pack back to front. You can see he's having a mare today. We've got ourselves an Andy Robertson. Mickey van der Ven uh, was absolutely schooled by Isaac the other week. We have our first silver of the day, a Virgil van Dijk. As far as silvers go, that's pretty good. We'll take that. These are non-numbered. Uh, you get five in your box, people. Uh, but that is a nice one. Van Dijk, we will certainly take that. Let's get him uh, slipped into there. I've got pack dust all over my fingers. That's come off one of the cards. That's minion, to be fair. Don't know what that's off about. I think that's the foil. That's the foil of the packs. The foil of the packs is staying in my fingers, people. This isn't good. This isn't good. So, moving that across there. Uh, we've got Virgil van Dijk placed in there. And then we'll just put our insert pile maybe next to it there. Look at that. That's a little bit better, isn't it, people? That's a little bit better. Uh, and we're going to fly through the rest of this pack now. So, we have ourselves a Martin Odegaard. We have a Yango. We have Morgan Gibbs-White. Lucas Digny. Andreas Pereira. Cody Gakpo. Josh Cullen, and that sees out the rest of that pack. So, first silver has been secured. Uh, Virgil van Dijk is pretty good, I would say. So we'll take it, we'll take it. We have Yves Basuma up next, Mateo Kovacic, Ansu Fati, and Andre Santos, uh, Endo for Liverpool. We have a Destiny Udogi insert card. That is nice right there, people. We then have a Joachim Anderson. Bruno, my boy Bruno G., I'm praying he doesn't leave at the end of the season. What a baller he is. Uh, my favourite player. We then got Sergio Rie, Nathan Collins, and that sees out the rest of that one. So here we go, people. Another one. Uh, almost through the first of three piles worth of cards. Here we go. Next one. Got a Villa player at the back. We have a Josh Brownhill, my boy Sean Longstaff, William Saliba, a Nathan Patterson. We then have the blue people. I have no idea what it's number two. But we spoiled the player. It is a blue to 15. Arnold Dan Juma of Everton. Look at that. A nice little blue. Six of 15. Arnold Dan Juma. There we go, people. Again, a fantastic number. Not necessarily the player I would have been looking for. But that is a to 15 and a to 20 inside one box to score. That, people, I would say is pretty good. Look at that there, people. We take it. We take it and we move. Dan Juma, number to six of 15, is our second number card inside this box of scores. So let's get rid of the inserts now, people. We're going to need the space. Here is our second number card. The colours look great on this as well. I, maybe I did throw a bit too much shade at this collection at the beginning, but I think the autograph checklist just doesn't help it. Uh, it just doesn't help it out. But hey, look at that. Two very nice numbers so far to 20 and to 15, which is really good. So we then have ourselves a Rodri, Necker Williams, Beto, my boy Pope, and a Yuri Tillmans to finish. Right, here we go, people. Nearly halfway through this box, I reckon. We are nearly halfway through. So next pack, we have Marvellous Nakamba of Luton. Sadly, it looks like they are leaving us from the Premier League. Um, got it for Luton. Really wanted them to stay up. That They just couldn't find those last few results. We have Kevin Shade, John Duran, Lissandro Martinez, a pure class, uh, Matty Cash of Villa. We then got Thomas Stuchek, Philip Billing, John Stones, Destiny Doggy, and a Dominic Calvert Lewin. Right, here we go. We're on to pile number two now, people. Let's go. Pile number two. Look at that. Another Jared Bowen already. We have Jared Bowen again. We have John McGinn. A silver, Dejan Kulusevski. Let's go. Uh, had a banging first season for Spurs and just hasn't hit those levels since. We have a Jao Palinha, a Wony, Darwin, Darwin, you hear that song. Ben Chilwell, Diego Dallo, Fodringham, and a Lewis Dobbin to finish. So let's sleeve uh, Dejan. Uh, I'm not putting them in top loaders for now, my silvers. They're not super valuable, uh, but I will probably look to move all of these on my eBay channel. So keep an eye over my eBay for any of those cards that you see 
inside today's video. So next one, here we go. We're starting off with once upon a time he was a star boy. We have Ansu Fati uh, of Barcelona and Brighton. We then have ourselves Christopher and Cuckoo, a Callum Wilson. We've got Big Cow inside our pack. We've got Tommy Yasu. We've then got, oh, this could be an autograph. Could this be an autograph or is it just teasing us? No, it's not an autograph. Ah! I thought that was the back of a card. I thought that was the back of a card. Um, autographs are usually back to front. I was thinking Erling Haaland. We've done it, people. We've done it. But we haven't. It's just a keeper's Edison. Ah, we've got Darwin Nunes again. Ben Chilwell. Matasa. Madweke. Cunha. And that finishes off. The next pack. Ah, people. I got so excited there. I got so, I got so excited. Ah, people. Give us a big hit. Give us a big hit. We have Yves Basuma, Matej Kovacic, Bueno Buenonote. We have Levi Colwell, He Chan Huang, a insert Zaniolo, Harry Wilson, Yon Visser, Sander Berge, Kyle Walker to finish. Right, here we go, people. We're going to go from pile number one now. We're going to shake it up, see if we can get that luck to change. This pack is a mess as well. Look at that. It's like double wrapped. Uh, it's like past the parcel. It's a bit like a top pristine even. So here we go. We have ourselves a Carlton Morris, Christian Norgard, James Tarkowski, a Langa, Virgil van Dijk, a Inset Alvarez. We then have Mason Mount, John Egan, Edison, Castiedo, and that finishes off the next one. So we still have three silvers to find and not many packs left. So I don't know when we're going to see the next numbered hit. We still have one more numbered hit to find there, people. Uh, this Carlton Morris looks like he's been absolutely savaged uh, in the printing machine. we then got Christian Norgard, Zeki Amdouni, a Rico Henry, Bruno Fernandes. Oh, Alexander Ezot, first class. Let's go. I was really hoping to get golden boot, but it looks like um, Harlan's turned up when he needed to. We've got Alfonso Ariola, Bakai Saka, Mohamed Salah, and a Dringer to finish. So looking at those powers, people, I reckon we've got six packs left. Six packs left. Come on, people. We need a big, big hit from score. Come on. Let's redeem yourself, score. Here we go. Deliver the sauce as we go through this video. So I think we've got a silver, people. We've got Alison Becker, Gustavo Hamer, Erling Haaland. Let's go. Erling Haaland, silver. Come on, people. Why is it not the blue or the pink? That would have been some banging hits. Ah. Oh. Panini score, you know how to tease me. A very nice silver Erling Haaland. One of the best silvers you're going to get inside this collection. A nice silver Erling Haaland. Ah, look at that. Very, very nice card. Three silvers down. Two more to go there, people. Erling Haaland. Why couldn't he be the blue to 15? Colour match. Banging card. But score, you continue to tease. You continue to tease me. So, we've got Enzo Fernandez. Nelson Semedo, Ryan Giles, Robert, Robert Sanchez, Alexander Rizak, Douglas Luiz, and Zinchenko to finish. So here we go, people. Here we go. Next one. This pack feels thick. This pack feels thick. This could be good. We have Hot Rookie of the Year, Kobe Minu of Man United. We've got a David Raya, a Jeffrey Schlupp, a Zabani for Bournemouth, Aaron Hickey. Oh... Final, final, just final numbered hit is Bubakar Kamara to 25 on what looks like a bronzy gold colour right there. Bubakar Kamara, no big, big players from our number parallels, but they're all low numbers, which is crazy. We have a to 20, a to 25, and a to 15, all inside our box, which is fantastic, but they're not, they're not big players. Bubakar Kamara is a great player. Danjuma is great. Antonio is great. <sighs> People, look at that right there. Number to 25, Bubakar Kamara of Aston Villa. What I will say, people, is that I have been a little bit surprised uh, with how good this collection has actually been, to be fair, in terms of design. Uh, design on this is fantastic. I just wish... I just wish they had the autographs to go with it, people. I just wish they had the autos to go with it. But I'm enjoying this. I'd probably say it's more on par with superstars than I maybe first anticipated. I've been surprised as we've gone through this. Not just because of the hits, but those coloured parallels do look really good. You can't deny that. You cannot deny it. So, we have a handful more to go. 
uh, I do believe on here. I can't even remember which pile it was. Uh, I think it's this one. We've got Hoyland, Martinez, Jensen, and Diego Jota to finish. Right. So, going into the final few packs, people. All the numbers have been found. So, what it does mean is we've got two more silvers to find in today's video. And hopefully, an autograph hit from these final packs. So, we have Sven Botman, Batman at the back. Trent Alexander-Arnold, Jordan Pickford, Ian Martin, a hot rookies, Ryan Giles. My voice went there. We've got Brian Buemo, Matthias Franker again, Moises Casiedo, Jose Sarr, and Kai Havertz to finish. Right, five packs now, people. Two of these will have silver parallels inside. So here we go, people. We have got ourselves a Jeffrey Schlupp. Uh, been a victim of the printing machine by the look of it. We have ourselves Anthony Gordon, beast on the wing. Rumoured that Liverpool want to pay 100 million for him. I wouldn't sell him for 100. Also, don't think he'd go to Liverpool being an Everton fan, but hey ho, a nice Anthony Gordon right there. We've got Andre Nana, Billy Gilmore, a Kirkes, McAllister, Mitoma, a silver Lewis Dobbin. I didn't think it'd be that far in the pack, but with a nice rookie silver, Lewis Dobbin of Everton. So. Let's get him down on the silver pile in front of us. What I will do is they're going to have to overlap. So I'll put Lewis Dobbin, rookie there, and then just overlap Erling Haaland on the top. There we go. So, people, that means there is only one more silver to find with Nick Pope and Tielemans finishing off that pack. So, here we go, people. Four more packs, one silver, and hopefully one autograph to find. So, in this one, we have ourselves a Ben White of Arsenal. Uh, Odson, Eduard, Raphael Varane, Gabriel Jesus, score team, Kieran Trippier. We'll take that. We then got ourselves Emiliano, Emiliano Martinez. I'm running out of pronunciations. Harry Wilson, Jan Visser, Dan Juma, and Matt Turner to finish, which means we're coming down to final three packs here, people. Final three packs. Come on, people. Autograph hit. Let's go. We have Kobe Minu up next again. We have a rookie Minu. We have David Raya, Mark Flecken, a Kashmiro, Thomas Party, Jose Saar score team. Let's start together. We've got Alexis McAllister, Karu Matoma, Vicario, Beto to finish. So it doesn't look good, people. Two packs to go. One will have a silver in it. Can we find an auto? Can we find an auto? I've never hit an auto from score. Is today going to be that day? We have Ollie Watkins, Luke Shaw, Curtis Jones, Hyung Min Son, Josko Gavardiol, Philip Billing, John Stones, Silva, Wes Frodingham, the goalkeeper, which is good because it means the final pack could be final pack magic. We then have ourselves a Marcus Rashford and Emerson Royale to finish. So sleeve up that Frodingham. And then that means we are on last pack magic, people. Can that last pack save the video with an autograph hit? There we go. Here it is, people. Final pack magic. Is there an autograph in our final pack of Panini score? We've got another Anthony Gordon right here, people. We've got Anthony Gordon right here. We have Anthony Gordon, Alison Becker, Gustavo Hamer, Dominic Schobberslai, Richarlison. Oh. Gusto breakthrough. I think it means we're not going to have an auto here, people, but we've got to believe that maybe we do. Papi Matasar, Milos Kerkej, Gabriel Martinelli, and Garnacho to finish. No autographs again, people. Panini score evades us once again. No autographs inside that box, but a couple of nice number parallels. We are going to take 30 seconds, people, and we are going to summarise today's video. So there we are, people. There are the hits from today's box opening. We've got a nice silver Erling Haaland. We then got a Bubakar Kamara to 25. We've got a Mikel Antonio to 20. And then we've got Dan Juma of Everton to 15. Look at that, people. Some low numbers, but sadly, not the biggest hits we could have had from that box. We'll take low numbers all day long, but the autograph also evaded us. So overall, what did I think of the product? Better than I originally thought. Uh, in terms of the designs, but again, the autograph checklist, not fantastic. There's so many player stats in this collection, it is difficult to hit big. So I'm sticking with my three star out of five. I did thoroughly enjoy it. 
even though I enjoyed it, what I would say to people is I would save the money for a different product, personally. That's where I'd sit with this. Save your £80 for flagship. Save it maybe for a bit of chrome. Yeah, thumb rip, but not the biggest one out of there. So if you enjoyed today's video, then make sure you smash that like button. Do comment. Let me know your thoughts on the product. And finally, do subscribe. Never to miss a single video from your boy Blazy. I'll be back hopefully late this week with UCC Finest and Panini Donruss. But for now, people, have a fantastic evening and I'll see you soon for the next video.